of our organization is Teach Peace Build Peace Movement. Uh, I actually have uh, personal reasons at the same time yung, uh, personal experiences or that really um, paved the way for me to decide na to form an organization like that. Um, for my personal reasons, well, I was seven years old during the Gulf War. And you know, I had my own experience of war. And I know how it is. Um, how, how it is it like? How is it like you know, to be faced with conflict, to be, to be faced with uh, to, to be faced with violence. And uh, ko sa ko, even when I was still younger, I don't want more children to experience conflict. And one of the uh, things that I discovered is that children are the most uh, affected sector when it comes to, to war. 60% na affected when it comes to war ay children. And yet, um, strategic interventions are needed to be strengthened para ang ating bata ay hindi lamang biktima or hindi sila yung perpetrators parang mas maganda na sila mismo we empower them to become to, to be part of the peace building process at a very young age we empower them to um, help build a culture of peace in their community and eventually it will be um, Will expand or spread all over all over the country. So we focus on children as our way of um, preventing conflict. We conflict prevention, conflict transformation, peace education, and you know, proactive citizenship uh, peace building. So yeah, so we begin at uh, a very young age because we believe that uh, we need to nurture the hearts and minds of our children especially in their formative years. So, so siguro nagtataka kayo bakit diba, yung uh, mission is to make every Filipino child in the peace builders. Bakit tayo magtuturo ng peace sa mga sundalo? Siyempre sila yung nandun sa community nga, sa so may mga units sa community na hindi natin abot, hindi naman tayo makapunta basta basta sa mga areas na yun. So yung mga knowledge natin, skills na i-impart natin sa kanila para sila mismo pagbalik nila doon, makapagturo sila ng peace sa community, sa mga bata, sa youth doon. Okay? So, yung objectives ng workshop na ito is parang matuto sila ng mga iba't ibang creative at innovative strategies and components para sa isang effective at ano, effective engagements ng mga sundalo kung magita ng usaping pangkapayapaan. Sa EFP kasi meron silang pinatawag ng Civil Military Operation. So, ang lugar na ito ay pinatawag ng Civil Military Operation School kung saan tinuturuan sila kung paano makipag-deal o makipag- halubilo sa mga civilians. So, tuturuan rin sila kung paano sila mag-engage sa mga youth, paano ba mag-engage sa bata, paano ba mag-engage sa community sa pamagitan ng mga prepare natin sessions. Naisip namin na improve yung curriculum pa ng school which is to, in particular yung cultural awareness and uh, syempre pumunta kami sa community to, to collaborate. Uh, naisip namin na magandang ipasok yung yung uh, advocacy ng teach peace sa ating mga civil affairs students. So, yung nagsimula lang. Bang snap, clap, ba bang snap, clap, snap, clap, ba bang snap, clap. Okay, ganun lang siya ang simple. Okay, gawin natin. <laughs>
people smiles and that kind of mood that people have every time they share their experiences after after the mga peace missions because it made me realize na possible pala yung unity kahit na iba-iba kami ng mga religion or ethnic groups or belief systems and what to do to is kung paano ulit makinalubino sa mga katulad nyo, mga yun, then makipag-participate sa mga yun. Then makipag-participate sa mga activity kaya na itong pitch-piece with this. Then kami rin na maraming matututunan din sa inyo din kay Kors kaya rin maraming matututunan sa inyo. Na aasahin sa mga lingkit ng lugar, medyo mahirap para sa amin kasi Bilang sesuatu dalu, sesuatu dalu masih bang operate or kita kawal na kompat. So, natu tu nana kami di to. Umpanu nana kami, apa tu kami makai halu bilu, sama kawal kawatan, osa komuniti. Di mana? Okay. Siapa? 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 Yung kasi tinuturo ng Peach Peace, yung sinishare nila sa ating mga sunod. Isa kasi sa trabaho namin, bukod dun sa war fighting, which is fighting the enemy, is through civil affairs, which is to collaborate, to integrate resources, particularly dun sa mga areas na bihirang maabot ng mga government services because of, for one, uh, challenges to security, may mga conflict uh, areas. And we hope that uh, through this collaboration with Teach Peace, Mill Peace, um, matutuntay ang ating mga sudyante, yung ating mga sundalo, na no? uh, kilalanin yung kanilang mga sarili, and uh, makuha yung, yung pamamaraan ng Teach Peace as to how to impart yung konsepto ng kapayapaan para sa ating babayan na nasa ito ng mga tatarang We're looking forward na makakatulong ito sa aming mga sa aming trabaho pa bilang isang sundalo na nagpapakalat ng kakaiba. Why we just Pato? That's Pawan! Only one! Pawan! Why we just Pato? It's Pawan! Because as you know Bebek or Pato? Pawan! Can you live in two different area, right? Am I right? Yes. 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 In the land and in the river. Water or river. <laughs> That's why army supposed to do. We can live during the war and we can live during the peace. Peace for most of us is just a word. 
um, pag nagkakakwentuhan nga, no, um, laging tanong ng young generations natin, how can we contribute to peace e eh, ang daming mga conflicts around us? What can we do to help build peace? Think of peace as something big, uh, as something grandeur. But the truth is, we can all contribute to peace in our own ways and in our own spheres of influence. Kaya nga, in, in Teach Peace Will Peace movement, we use music, art, games, sports, and community service. Kasi we want to get the interest of every young Filipino. Uh, we, we encourage uh, the youth to use their talent, we, to use their skills para makakontribute to peace. Teach Peace Will Peace movement is a family. Mahala. It's a family because for us, kahit may isang mission kami, kahit nagaling kami sa iba't ibang place, different cultures, age, sex, religion, uh, nagkakaisa kami with a common goal. If we really want to build peace in our nation, it is very important that if we want peace, let us live peace. And if we want peace, let us act for peace. Thank you for watching!